YouTube, what's good? It's your girl Jasmine. I'm back with another video on the channel. Gang. Gang. Let's get it, gang. Let's get it, gang. Hey, hog. Hog, y'all in the video. We got Tom McDonald. Okay. Somebody was like, you know, I know you gotta, you got, you just got introduced to Tom, but you gotta get to the, you gotta get to the beef that he had with Mac Lethal. I have never heard of Mac Lethal. I don't know if he raps. I don't know if he sings. I don't, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I just don't know. So I've never heard of him. So this is all new to me. This is all brand new to me. Tom is new to me as well. Just only found out about him a few months ago. You know? So I feel so behind on everything. And this is pretty old. I think it's like a year or two old. So with this beef, I have no idea what it's about. I don't know idea what it started. But they said everything will be laid out in the videos for me. And... So yeah, we gonna see. Y'all gotta fill me in the comments down below what happened, what y'all think. Y'all gotta let me know. You know I love when y'all talk to me now. So the first one up, they told me to go in this order. If this order is wrong, I apologize. I'm just going by what this person said. First video is about Tom. And the first thing I see, he got a little, got a little banner up here from Matt. So let's get it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, push a notification bell so you get notifications. I post follow my Instagram at Beast with Jay. With that being said. Tom, hog, yep, first, let's get it. <laughs> Hold on, let me read this real quick. This white dude who raps about how white dudes are super oppressed is garbage. I don't know his name, not gonna learn it. His bars are fucking awful, and he can shove his entire low rent as the. Okay. So that's what Max said first on May 29th. <laughs> like, talk shit about Tom McDonald and. Realize. Hello, I'm here to appropriate black culture while some him is whining about how white are the victims. Sorry, y'all. I want to read out loud just in case y'all can't see, but I'm sure 99.9% of y'all already know about this and already read it, but this is my first time seeing it, so I have to pause and read it to make sure I'm staying on top of what's going on. I said, so many of my fans were his fans, and now they're all mad at me, so I'm just going to tell them that I was talking about somebody else. That's it. Yo, <laughs> they are rolling with the comebacks. Hold on, this is long win. First of all, I don't know who you are. I haven't heard of your music until now. That tweet was about someone much smaller than you. Hmm, they always try to put on somebody else. However, if you feel like it applies to you, fine. I'll play along. I don't think your aesthetic is low rent, though. Your videos are very well produced. I also don't see any videos of you outright seeing white men are oppressed. But maybe I didn't watch the right ones. Which leads to my next point. I have 2 million more YouTube subscribers than you. So, my views are down 40% this month and your views are up 50% and I still have 1 million more views than you. I have also, I've also sold the club you're talking about over 40 times. I didn't bring any of this relevancy up. <sighs> yeah, 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 I was talking about somebody else. You believe me, right? <laughs> right? <laughs> he said, I guess I'll play a lot. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm going to be I ain't this video. I dropped one. Ooh, got him. Also, seems like a large portion of your fan base doesn't care to pay attention. I just dropped straight away. You know, five days ago, you clip your job. I ain't going to hold you. When I, first, when I first seen Tom, when I first, like, met him, got into this stuff, I thought his views was crazy. You know what I'm saying? For somebody, of you know, who I don't even, haven't even heard of, he has mad views. You know what I'm saying? And... That says a lot right there, because there's so many people in this world, it's just crazy to know, like, dang, he got this much following, and I haven't even heard of him? Crazy. So, I don't know, like, people always throw views and stuff in there, it's just of how supportive your fan base is, you know? Like, and I, Tom, Hogg, y'all go crazy for Tom, like, y'all supportive as heck, and that's one thing I rock with y'all about, because I love a supportive fan base, like, Tom got that for sure. Oh, shit. Alright. Man, who gave this old man Twitter? <laughs> Who taught him how this works? Someone tell him when he mentions me, do research first. <laughs> yo, 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 I'm sorry. This probably gonna be a lot of positive video. If you like that, you can peace out. You know what I'm saying? It's my channel. It's other channels who do the same thing. But this is about to be hilarious because to me, Tom is hilarious, bro. Like, Tom is hilarious to me. Like, he's funny. He just old and bitter. 
can't hit him where it hurts Cause it's impossible to make this guy look any worse Hey, the world forgot about Mac Now you can't eat Ramadan fast That Oxycontin you put up your nostril Finally rot your brain or where you always wag Whoa, Ooh. I should go slow <laughs> I don't want you back on the dope It ain't a joke when you're going broke And you got a daughter at home <laughs> Leave me alone you old man Your career is a joke, it's so sad Your biggest record is a cover song While you cooking breakfast, you ain't no dad He said his bigger, his biggest record was a cover song Ooh Ooh <laughs> Fucking housewife, fucking washed up, fucking never ever had a sound. How you rap with ICP and still end up the biggest clown? Mac Lethal? What's lethal about him? Old age, stroke face, a relapse going back to his old ways, a suicide because no fame? You ain't a real artist. <gasps> Tom. Tom. Hold on, y'all. Tom. You. Oh. Is he old, y'all? Is Mac old? I guess I'm going to find out on his disc. Don't worry. It's all going to be in the same video. So make sure y'all stay tuned with me. Stay, Take the journey with me, y'all. Even though y'all seen it, still take the journey with me. Hold on. It was old ways. A suicide because no fame. You ain't a real artist. You just retarded. You a weak target. I feel bad for killing. You rap fast, but every bar's filler. We kept lethal, but we lost Miller. Ooh. Ooh. R.I.P. Mac Miller, man. For real. I'm, I rocked with Mac Miller. No lie. You say, ooh, okay, Tom, okay, Tom. I guess your tweet is backfired. Go look up satire. I guess you're slower than you look, Mac. You got flat tires. I'm a visionary, you a parody. Your catalog is embarrassing. You pushing 40, your style is corny. Stop rapping and do some parenting. Fuck, I guess it's that time of the year. Hi, I'm here to revive your career. Guy, you come off so fucking weird. It's 2019, just admit that you're queer. I don't expect to get a tight response from a midlife crisis with writer's block. Even though it'd be nice to talk to a rapper who can't even write a song. I mean, I was expecting Tom. I like I I was expecting this from Tom, but I wasn't expecting this from Tom. If y'all get like I don't I don't know. I'm just shocked that he said all this. Ah, uh, you know, what y'all think? Cause some people don't like when, uh, when people comment on people when people comment on people's parenting skills. Like people don't like when kids get brought up because it has nothing to do with the kids. I don't have kids, so I don't really have a say so in this. So cause I really don't know how it feels. If somebody say something about my child, I would assume that I would be mad and be like, yo, don't talk about my kid or like my kid has nothing to do with this. But some people look at it like, ah, uh, he's just trying to get to me. I ain't worried about it. Talk about my kid all day type thing. But I don't know. If you have kids, you a parent and somebody's coming for you, throw your kid saying like your parenting skills are whack and people take like their parenting skills to heart because people go so hard for their kids or should. So as a parent, I'm sure some of y'all parents out there or, you know, a guardian or some of that nature. And how would y'all feel? You know, how would y'all feel? I can't say nothing because I don't have a kid. But how, how do y'all feel? Like if somebody was coming for you and your kid or said like parenting skills, blah, blah, blah. Not that I'm saying like Tom did that, but I'm saying like he threw it in there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> he said you go through a midlife crisis. Tom was like, "Why am I? Why am I doing this?" But since you want to do it, I'm gonna do it. You know what I'm saying? Okay, Tom. But still, y'all let me know. It's a talk to a rapper who can't even write a song. Wow, look at you now. I'm selling out shows in your town. Your demographic, all old ladies. You don't appeal to a younger crowd. You ain't mainstream. You ain't underground. You a specific brand of fucking lame. Your triple time flow, hella boring. How you say so much and have nothing to say? You are all opinions. I am all facts. You are insignificant. Fall back. Need an update. Reinstall Mac. You can restart and then not rap. Yo, Tom is comedy, bro. Tom, hey, Tom got jokes. Tom got jokes. He's coming for him, Mac. This is late, bro, but he was coming for you. He was coming for you. He, he had his. He was ready. He was ready. I feel like Tom was ready and waiting for a diss. No lie. Hold on, like, cause what? All back, need an update, reinstall Mac, you can restart and then not rap. <laughs> Picture your life, flipping burgers, go get me some fries, cola with ice, one apple pie on the side, David, I'm trying to be nice. I seen your reply in my comments, you said it wasn't about me, come on, just be honest. You spoke out the ass and then all of your fans started turning against you, it fucks up your pockets, you're backpedaling, you don't have enemies, you're afraid to have to deal with that energy, you're lying and trying to make up a save, you said it, you meant it, David's too late, oh dear, I can't believe I have to set this shit straight. Man, old ears, I hope you hear exactly what I say. Man, I'm here, 
You said you didn't even know my name, dawg. So here, I'll say it so you don't forget it, gang. It's Tom McDonald, bitch. <laughs> it's who? <laughs> who is it, y'all, Hulk? Who is it? Get it, gang. It's Tom McDonald, bitch. <laughs> Period. That's what he said. That's what he said. Well, you know who it is, all right? That was Lethal Injection by Tom McDonald Hogg. That was the first one. Now, let's see how Mac responds, because I'm very interested to know what he looks like. I'm very interested to know how he sounds. I'm very just interested. So let's get it. Don't go nowhere. Okay, baby. We got Mac Lethal on the screen. Okay. I, now I got a face with a name. Now I got a face with a name. I don't know what I was expecting, but now I got a face with a name. So let's see. Let's see what you guys say back, bro. Let's get it. Hey, y'all let me know more about Mac Lee down below, because I haven't, like I said, I never heard of him. Never heard of him. And I never heard of Tom, but y'all gave me so much information about Tom. Now I know more about Tom. So if y'all know more about Mac, let me know. But let's get it. Little story about a single white female. Her name is Tammy, but you'll need some fine details. She gets up on the internet and argues with strangers, because inside she's full of insecurity and anger. She tries to be edgy. That's her rap ploy. But back in the day, she was a frat boy. Tom was a frat boy? What? I couldn't even imagine. What? Not the pictures popping up, though. I like that. I like the pictures popping up. Hey, y'all know I'm not... Y'all know I don't pick one side or nothing. I'm, I just go with what, how I feel. Y'all know I'm not... I don't do that one-sided thing. I don't... I just tell y'all... Just, I'm just real with it. Like, I just let y'all know how I feel. Y'all may not agree. Y'all may agree. But I'm let y'all know. Because I know I got a lot of hog family members. And that's cool. Because I, I rock with Tom. I do. Like, I... I like his music, but if I hear something good or a, a good enough for a comeback, or if I, y'all just gotta respect my opinion. But anyway, let's go. I like the pictures that he's popping up. But back in the day, she was a frat boy. She says everybody hates her, but no one even cares. So now I'm gonna grab the bitch and throw her by the hair. Hey, yo, single white female, it's time to make the J burn. Where's your fucking balls, bitch? You acting like you gray worm. How you gonna let a little tweet hurt your feelings? Did I bruise your ego, little girl? What are you revealing? Your whole fucking gimmick is claiming everybody's too PC and sensitive. So why you want some victim shit? If somebody don't like you, that shit straight troubles you. Why the fuck you acting like an SJW? His, his beat is giving me an old school vibe. That's for sure. <laughs> he's trying to be funny. Like, he's trying to be funny with this. When he got his daughter's headphones on. That's funny. But come on. You rapping like you want to make America great again. But you're not even American, Tammy. You're Canadian. You live in the safest fucking country in the world. And you act like you're a press man. You're such a little girl. Speaking of little girls, you want to diss my daughter? Damn, that's a cheap shot. That's so damn disgusting, man. Well, I can throw cheap shots, too. Let's talk about the fact your girlfriend used to suck off R.A. the rugged man. You Wait, what? Who is that? Hold on, y'all, because y'all know I don't even know nobody, but do what? Just to suck off R.A. the rugged man. I have no idea who that is, but he said used to. People, I love this tracks, you know, just because they throw information we never knew. But, you know, y'all may have known, but I didn't know. This is new to me. You know, so this is all like, what? But everybody got a pass, man. You know, things happen. I don't even know if it's true or not. I don't even know who this man is on the screen. So I really can't say too much about this because I really don't. I didn't know them. I don't. I really don't know that much. But it's just funny on diss tracks. They be trying to throw every dirty, dirty thing that you have done on a diss track, you know, to make you, like, hurt or suffer because apparently Tom said something to make him, like, hurt. So he's like, okay, let me get him back. Let me dig and let me dig and so get some receipts and get him back. And Tom, if this happens, I'm sure Tom already knew about it. They already discussed it. It is what it is. Moved on. You know what I'm saying? It probably was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. We knew about that. Like, it's over with. Like, this, this is old type thing. But anyway, that's crazy. Let's go. Man, you want to say I'm rapping filler? Your girl is a king of the dot groupie that be letting rappers filler. We got mutual friends. They gave me dirt. These are facts. Your girlfriend ghost writes half your raps. Ooh. Okay. We all know Nova's talented. I don't, I don't think that's a, a hidden. I don't think that's hidden. Um, but if she does, I'd rather for it to be Nova than, you know, like a company. 
Like, I mean, I feel like everybody got a ghostwriter. You know what I'm saying? But some people are really talented and don't need a ghostwriter. Teach your own. is what you like. These are facts. Your girlfriend ghost writes half your raps on YouTube. The biggest video of mine has more views than all your fucking videos combined. Speaking of YouTube, you claim that I'm irrelevant. I got two million more fucking subscribers than you do. You wear women's clothes and Nicki Minaj braids because you gotta hide the fact that you secretly got AIDS. You think that I'm not paid? Silly bitch, I'm a millionaire. You want proof? Meet me at the bank and I'ma kill you there. Whoa! Whoa! This is a lot, Mac. Mac, this is a lot of information, bro. Like, you're saying a lot. Oh, like, whoa. Whoa, hog. Hog, y'all gotta let me know what y'all thought when y'all heard this. Was y'all upset? Was y'all like, oh, dang. Like, was y'all surprised? And if you a Mac Lethal fan, y'all gotta let me know, too. Because, like I said, I don't pick sides. I just go to how, how I just say how I feel. You know what I'm saying? Cause what? Not paid, silly bitch. I'm a millionaire. You want proof? Meet me at the bank and I'ma kill you there. White on white violence. Damn it's snowing. You're the fucking rap equivalent of Candace Owens. I heard you block people on Twitter because they told you Mac Lethal is bigger. Sweet Jesus, you're bitter. What's the matter, Lele Pons? Did my lethal injection get stuck in your VJJ wrong? Aw, oh, what's the matter, Meth Lamore? You need another stupid white boy gimmick to move some units at the record store? You're not a lyricist. You're not controversial. No one is offended by you, and that really hurts you, bro. You lie about your height. You're not 6'5", you little man. You look like Kid Rock had a meth baby with Lil Xan. You <laughs> what? But, no, what's funny to me right now is, like, he's saying that he keeps bringing up the whole views and numbers and subscriber things. Okay, you have more subscribers. Okay, 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 whatever. But I guess I can't really say that because I didn't know Tom either. And he had a lot. He had a lot of subscribers, whatever. I don't know you. I really don't know you. I mean, I, I don't know. There's so many people in the world. I don't know a lot of people. And I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I just don't know. I don't know. I'm rambling right now. Let me stop. Come on. You look like Lil Pump had a crack baby with bad baby. What's the matter, Elsa? Why you acting sad lately? I'm a martial artist. You fake wrestle, bitch. You aren't the man, but you do look like Becky Lynch. Ladies and gentlemen, coming to the ring. Oh, right he got now, real footage. This man is a Canadian who would give anything to be American. Standing five foot eight, I mean uh six foot five, weighing seventy-two pounds, Tammy Mick. Oh. The fact that this dude got wrestling footage of Tom, bro, that's cr <laughs> Hold up, hold up. Hog, oh, y'all probably gonna come for me. But what I like when people have diss tracks is they put actual footage into what they're what they're dissing about. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's crazy. That's crazy. He really did his research, or he really paid some people to get some stuff to him for this. That's crazy. <laughs> Oh shit, let's watch this wrestling video. Oh my god, what kind what kind of fucking move is that? What is that? <laughs> In your diss song, you tried to say corny. That, I was gay, right? that was corny. You're the motherfucker that be dressing up in gray tights. See, you and other half naked men can fucking play fight. You just need an excuse to lay there and take pipe. In America, hog is another word for dick, which is the reason that you have it tatted underneath your lip. Cause you love dick, bro. You give enough head. You wear nail polish, motherfucker. Nuff said. You ain't skilled. Bruh. That was corny, too. That was corny, too, bruh. Who cares if you wear a nail polish? That don't mean you gay. That just means you just, that's just what you like. You know what I'm saying? Come on now. Be quiet. You look like Billie Eilish did too many pills and got filled with violence and killed her stylist. I heard your diss, bitch. I ain't bust a sweat. You diss ICP, homie. Your girl's a juggalette. You say I'm in my 30s like this shit is a bad thing. I'm healthy and I'm rich and I'm living my rap dreams. My kids go to a nice private school. I got a sick fucking house. I own my own pool. How the fuck you gonna try to say I'm having an identity crisis? You're a 30 year old man dressing like this. I wear normal clothes. I don't need controversy and shock value. I grab the mic and pour my soul. Let this shit be a lesson in how you thirst fame. From here on out, your name is infinitely cursed, man. Cause if you say your last name, you have to say my first name. Bitch, my fucking rap name is in your fucking birth name, Mac. <laughs> I'm laughing because he is so serious. Like, he is so serious. But Tom is taking it like a joke. Like, 
It's like, bro, this is not, like, I'm just giving you some entertainment, giving you some, you know, giving you some uh, views, you know, because I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know how big Mac, Le Mac Lethal is. But he, Mac, hey, Mac was serious, bro. He was, he was ready. He was serious. It's like, he's serious, but Tom is like, jokingly, like, this is just entertainment, bro. Like, he's not serious. But Mac is more like, I'm gonna take him down. <laughs> okay. Okay, Mac. I mean, you came with some evidence. You came with some, um, uh, I don't know if they was facts or not, because, you know, I don't, I don't know. But you said some, you had, you had some good points on, you know. Um, it was entertaining. I'll say that. It's very entertaining. So let's see what Tom said in return. Because apparently Tom said something in return. Let's get it. Alright, y'all. Part two. Well, part three, per se. But part two of Tom. Let's get it, man. Let's get it. Because this is... This is this is funny to me. I'm not even taking it serious. I, I don't know if I... So this is funny. This is real funny. Um, Yo, what is going on? This is funny to me. Um, let's see what Tom, let's see what Tom says in his part two diss. Let's get it. <laughs> oh my God! Tower beats on the track. Listen, I think I can hear it. Mac Lethal is hyping himself in the mirror. His wife tries to tell him that she's getting curious. He just yells, "Shut the fuck up! It's just Tom guy serious." I hoped you would kill it. I'm always an optimist. Thought your response would be flawless and awesome. It's gotta be hard finding time to perfect all your rhymes every night at Narcotics Anonymous. Hi Dave, hi Dave, hi Dave. I'm not even trying. You don't scare me at all. If you did a drive by, I'd wait. No, like that. I just said that, bro. Like you can just tell Tom is just trolling. He's just having fun, bro. Like, like, cause what I just I just said that in Max video that he's like going like hard. He's trying to like put the just put the dagger in Tom, you know, like type thing. And Tom is like. Bro, like you said stuff that people already knew, but I didn't know, so it was like a surprise to me. But I'm sure y'all knew. And he's like, bro, you gotta come harder than that, cause this ain't enough. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on now, this is funny. This is funny. But he's like, I give you the, I give you some fame while while we're here. I'll give you some fame, <laughs> cause really, Tom probably didn't have to make another diss track. Come on now. If it's so cute when you rap, it's like I'm watching my dad trying to use an iPad. You should just give it back. You've been sober like eight years. You're the type of guy who can't have a beer, have a single drink, and need to get some coke. And probably suck a dick for a painkiller. You party animal. You bad boy. You're a crazy son of a gun. All that karate and still you're a pussy. You tap on my shoulder and run. Where are you going? I'm over here in a house that you can't afford with your career. Got your own pool, kids in private school. You the fucking mother of the year. <laughs> Tom is hilarious, bro. He's hilarious. You keep talking millions. I googled your wealth. You are worth two, Dave. I am worth twelve. You're two. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Y'all almost dipped from this chair, bro. Almost dipped from this chair. What? Mm. That's embarrassing, Mac. Yeah, that's why you can't be putting numbers into it like that because all you got to do is Google. Even though sometimes Google ain't right, but it sure is close. You know, I'm sure it ain't that far off. Boy. Of the year. You keep talking millions. I Googled your wealth. You are worth two, Dave. I am worth 12. You're tweeting at YouTube. Somebody help with my monetized videos. Dave, that's a tell. Broken, ugly, <laughs> short, and <laughs> Y'all weak. Tom is hilarious, bro. Tom is hilarious. Dave, that's a tell. Broken, ugly, short, and stubby, 40 something with a face that was born for punch and act tough. But I know at your court's muffins, the type to wife up the first horror fuck them. Big bad Dave got the Ellen Co sign. Cool. Try to ride that wave to the Hollywood sign. Fool. You were so excited just to get invited. Teeth were freshly white and couldn't cheese enough. You said, I love rap because it's counterculture. Dave, counterculture is who beats you up. My future has Grammys. Your future is handies from Tammy imagining baddies in nasty pajamas and transplanting hair to your head from your fanny. I saw you doing teeth commercials. You an actor, Dave. I don't need rehearsals. I'll piss in your mouth till you wheeze and gurgle and stomp on your head till your cheeks are purple. I y'all, I want to hear y'all's comments on this, bro. This is crazy. This is crazy. Who is Emily? Who's Emily, y'all? I love seeing tattoos on uh, Tom's face up close because I can actually see them and like really see what they are because some of them I can't tell what it is. But anyway, 
Let's go. I was a wrestler. I wore spandex. You were a customer. You did Xanax. I'll take you and your bitch by the ear and then smash you together like Stone Cold's beer. Being a fucking loser's in your DNA. This ain't a punchline. It's a PSA. The chromosomes from your mom and pop create retards and they name them Dave. Nobody's safe. The wifey to chain up her legs. Remove all her eggs. Put them in bags and then lock them away in the safe and send it away on a plane. I'm lucky that I know CPR. My girl heard you this and she died laughing. She was bummed. We waited like a week and then she went right back into Minecrafting. My girl was on Def Jam. Your girl look like Death Fam. Bruh. I'm done. I'm done. Tom came back with the part two and was like, it's over. I'm about to end this right now. That's what he said. He said, I'm about to end this right now. Put this kid to bed. Just stop. Oh my. Oh my. He said, bro. Bro. Why you doing what? My girl was on Def Jam. Your girl look like death, fam. She the Grim Reaper, knew at spit ether. She collecting the soul of a dead dad. They're gonna need a whole family of coffins when you Chris Benoit to solve all your problems. The shame and embarrassment. All of the comments from fans you had. I saw it, you lost them. Ain't dropped an album in four years. Dog, rapping is your hobby. My career less than a year. 20,000 physical copies. I have millions of streams. I'm living your dream. You're a glorified YouTuber. Look like a meme. Go to Stupid Extremes. Definition to try hard. Watch me rap after eating a Tide Pod. Dying for attention. That's why you started this little beef. You're so desperate. Expect that right after this ends, your sex day probably league. You've been on Ellen and Rogan, why aren't you a star? Here, let me tell you, it isn't the bars. It's the way that you look, it's the way that you are. Nobody cares about your music no more. Dog, you do impressions. You rap in 20 styles and you think it's flexing. I got a question, why you gotta pretend to be everyone else to resemble impressive? I killed you already, this don't need a sequel. I'm honestly bored with this shit. Literally, it's the fact that Tom is not even trying, but he's destroying dude right now. Literally. Literally. Destroy. <laughs> Dang, bro, that's sad. That's that's crazy. Cause what? He's wilding. He's wilding. I know Nova was like, "Get him, babe. Get him, babe. Go crazy." She um. Mm. I would hate to see his face when this came out. Like I'm sure Mac was probably like, oh, he probably was just laughing, like, <laughs> like trying to play it off. Dang. Feels like I'm kicking the corpse's shoes. You can't afford to feel horrible doing you like this. How many rappers wrote your response? Come on, Dave. Give him credit. I know you sent texts. I saw it with my eyes. I know what you said, Dave. I read it. You a real piece of shit. Now I'm like a real piece of shit. Like if a piece of shit ate a piece of shit and took a pee and shit, you're that piece of shit. I'm on like five minutes. Shit, let me see. You were canceled and fired from MTV. The network wanted something fresh and clean. I bet any day they'll be calling me. You left rhyme stairs cause you had to. You didn't walk away. It wasn't something you planned, dude. Got lost in the drugs and the whirlwind. Caught pants down with another man's girlfriend. Piece of shit. Nah, like a real piece of shit. Like if a piece of shit fucked a piece of shit and got an STD, you're that piece of shit. You got a pet bird, bet you never thought you'd be dead first. I'ma put you both in the oven when you get burned. I'ma put you both in a pet urn. Piss into the bottle, mix it up and turn the ash into plaster. Give it to your bitch. Tell her make statues of me just to capture my win. My girl will <laughs> spit in her face and will dip. Get a hammer and come back and smash it to bits. Put a plaque in its place so that no one forgets that your biggest mistake was as good as it gets for a guy whose career doesn't even exist. It's the peak of the mountain for you. This is it. Your aesthetic is pathetic. <laughs> Yo, Tom, bro. All I know, is, bro. Oh, y'all in the building. I know y'all was going crazy. Cause what, bro? This is, this is. I'm speechless. I now I'm just speechless because I didn't think top like. <sighs> wow. Like I said. When some when this person told me to do this, he was like, "You're going to be entertained." He was like, I don't care which side you agree on or whatever, but you're going to be like, your reaction, your review is going to be hilarious because you're going to think it's like crazy. Like, you're going to just be like, what? And I'm just like, I'm like, all right. Because I was just like, who is Mac Lethal? Like, I don't know. Like, I was like, so obviously it had to be somebody important because Tom like responds to him. But then like when I Google Mac Lethal, the only thing that came up about him was the diss. So I'm like, Okay. So I was like, let me just do this. This. So obviously, y'all let me know. Like, is he, like, I'm not even trying to joke because if you're a Mac Lethal fan, salute to you. Salute to you. You like, you like who you like. And I'm not, I'm never the type of person to bring anybody down and talk about anybody. Like, I just don't do that because I don't know. I don't know Tom. I don't know Mac. So I ain't really got nothing, like, bad to say. And they, to me, they're not saying nothing bad. They just, it's a diss. So th please don't take anything I say to heart. You know, I'm just enjoying the moment and the content. 
It's entertainment. It's very entertaining. But, all jokes aside, if he's a rapper, and I'm just being real, because let me know if I'm wrong. If he's a rapper, Mac Lethal, he said he's sold out so many things, blah, blah. Because when I typed in Tom, I'm like, who is Tom? When I got told to watch him the first time, review him. And, like, all his songs popped up. I'm not going to hold you. Not even just on YouTube, on Spotify, uh, iTunes, anything. Like, every, like all his, his whole playlist popped up. Type in Mac. Most popular thing that popped up was this diss. So I'm like, if he's a rapper, why ain't other, his other stuff popping up? You know what I'm saying? And it's just like, mm. you know, so I was kind of surprised that there was even a diss to begin with. Because it's like, Tom is probably just bored. Like, man, let me go ahead and just give him just a little bit of clap, a little bit of money in his pocket. Let's do this. But if I'm wrong, let me know. Like, for real. Like like I said, nothing against Mac, though. Nothing against, nothing against neither one of them. It's just entertainment is just fun. But still, that's just what I'm thinking right now. And, and it's very entertaining. Tom is hilarious right now. You don't get it, I'm prophetic, your rap ethetics are boring, fuck it, get his world record Be careful where you were headed, I'm cemented as a legend David Sheldon severed that is his destiny to be the evidence Every room you ever enter, I will always be the elephant While you try to fit this capital L into development You dead it in Lennon, I send a letter to heaven That explodes when it opens, I hope it gets your attention I can smell it, you sweating, and it's 11-11 I make a wish that when you die, you come back resurrected So I can kill you again and again and again for the record If you're feeling kinda froggy and you jump, you get dissected Oh dear, I can't believe I had to set this shit straight Man, old ears, I hope you hear exactly what I say Man, I'm here, you said you didn't even know my name Dog, so here I'll say it so you don't forget it, gang. It's Tom McDonald, bitch. <laughs> uh, y'all gotta let me know, bro. Y'all gotta let me know. I say, I say, cause you know, like I said, I don't speak ill nobody. I don't, I don't speak negative. I'm a very positive person. I'll try to be. I ain't perfect now, but I try to be positive as much as I can. So what I'm gonna say is, Mac, I like the fact that you had pictures and evidence, and you had like the little. Um, dressing up as Tom, I thought that was entertaining. That was that was cute. That was cute. Um, I feel like Tom just came a little bit harder, you know, because I feel like the stuff that Max said, Tom is like, who cares? Like, we already know that. Like, everybody already knows that. You didn't say anything that people didn't know, but I didn't know. Like, I didn't know Tom was a frat boy. I didn't know that Tom. Like, I knew Tom wrestled, but I never seen a clip. So that was that was funny that he threw that in there. But other than that, Tom kind of the kind of just basically destroyed this battle you know it, it was just kind of funny to tom and it was just funny it was just entertaining i just say that it's just very entertaining but y'all let me know in the comments down below what y'all think talk to me hog talk to me mac lethal fans if y'all out there let me know don't forget to like comment subscribe push your notification bell so you know in case i post follow my instagram be so much that means i see you guys next video